So Stav, day three of the Edinburgh Cup supported by Aberdeen Asset Management here in Weymouth. Uh, we had a single championship race today plus the crew race. Um, I see you've got a race winner and our overall leader with us. Uh, tell us a little bit about what's been going on. Well, it was a great day um, for racing. We, um, the rain held off in the beginning, which was great. And we managed to get one good race in with three proper beats. Um, Grant Gordon on my right here was the race winner. Um, Grant and I sailed together down in Cascais at the beginning of the year um, and then he went and bought a boat and I think that you wanted a boat very quickly so it was one of Tim's um, friends wasn't it? That's right, yeah. yeah. From Nicola and Thomas. That's right, yeah. And um, Paul Rickard, the man, this side of me, who's responsible for the Dragon class being what it is today. Um, he's too modest to say it himself but if it wasn't for the man we'd all be saying something else, I'm sure, by now. Um, first to you, Grant. Um, exciting race for you. What was your plan before the start? Well, I mean, first of all, it's great to be in this class, to be in the Dragon class, to be racing here in Weymouth. Um, so we've been working on, you know, trying to improve our performance, and particularly um, to get our starts better. So really what we wanted to do was focus on getting a, a nice clean start, uh, and we managed to sort of execute that today which gave us the opportunity to get off to a good race. So yeah. that, that's really, that, that was the main, the main sort of focus today. Now there were several black flags too, wasn't there? I, uh, I, I know about six boats. Um, so um, getting a good start today was not easy. No, that, that's true, but equally we managed to get, uh, uh, we managed to sort of line up, we could see the line quite clearly, we were yeah. close to it, but yeah, so good. off to a good start. And uh, you came in predominantly from the left hand side? Yeah, we uh, on 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 the first beat. That that's correct. Sort of, we we, we went up the left hand side and uh, we met our friend over here, very close to the uh, the top mark. Top, yeah. no, poor God, sir, God, my friend. Um, you were first to the first mark. Yeah. yeah. And Grant, somebody got past you down wind. What happened? Yeah, we uh, actually on the on the downwind, we actually moved away. We had a quite good lead and that. You know, it's going to be easy. Yeah. But uh, on the way down, I saw Mikada and Simon Brown coming quite quick. They was in, in a, some kind of wind uh, in, a, in my 500 meter or yeah. something like that, and they were coming much much closer in the, in the mid in the middle. Right. So I think uh, yeah, um, we are going a little bit to the left. Okay. And so uh, we took the left hand mark. Of the gate, and, okay. and the gate, and uh, we were then going. Ah, some, not bad. Uh, we were sitting up and yeah. good speed, and and then uh, we could see oh, it's not going to work so well. <laughs> uh, so we two, uh, we tack back. Okay. Did you take the other board, Grant? Yes. Ah. Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, yeah. No, we were fortunate that uh, we we took the other board. We thought it was a bit closer. Uh, so we were going to take that one in. Anyway. I think actually it was the right yeah. boy of the game yeah. was close. But 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 yeah. By yeah. what I would say, it was closer for you. Yeah, for us. Yeah. 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 Sure. For us, it was closer. And then I think we were lucky in a way. We came round the boy, and we were first to hit the new breeze. So we got yeah. a really nice clean yeah. sort of uh, clean sure. out of the boy and sort of into into the second beat. Yeah. Great. If we have when we tack again, try to get over to you. We. Uh, we have uh, 10 degrees, you're 10 degrees down, more okay. to you. Yeah. And I think, you know, yeah, it's, it was quite stable 10 degrees, and I also thought that your breeze would come from there. Yeah. So we continued instead of tacking on the leader, that was all a big mistake. Ah. We continued behind. You made, you made a mistake? Yeah, and you know, I'm sorry to say that, but that is true. And then we went out and tack again. Okay. And, uh, and um, and I have to say, I couldn't understand why you didn't tack with me. Mm. Uh, you were very confident in the way you were sailing. And uh, you sail up, and when you tack, you actually get a lift yeah. on the starboard. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I think, oh God, then I had to come back in, in another 220. Mm -hmm. And so that was not good for me. No. And then, when I think after that, I think we better stay close together. Yeah. It's better to be number two. For sure. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, let's face it, you've now, being second today, moved into the overall lead. So congratulations for that. Um, Paul Rickard is now on 20 points. Um, second is Klaus Diedrich on 21. Third is Gabby on 23. Two. Two. And fourth is Laurie Smith 
on 24. So, uh, Grant, congratulations, because that fifth moves you up to fifth, the first moves you up to fifth. But I think at 31 points, you're probably just out of, out of a chance to win, but a top five in this fleet is fantastic. Um, so, I hope you can win. Yeah, I think if they're all four yeah. black flags. No, yeah, yeah, then you will just win if you win. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They, yeah 32 so mathematically points. it's possible. Yeah. But, um, Boricon, so, uh, Weymouth, uh, the worlds, what do you think about the, the, the place on the water? Let's say on the water here. We, we, can, um, we can start to say that the, it's the first place I have been to where there's so much space. Space, yeah. If you, if you come to if you come to Regatta, it's always difficult with the trailer, and it's very difficult. And here they have been very helpful to, to get the boat in the water and it's going very quick. Yeah. You can see they have done it before. Yeah. And uh, also the arena down there, there's plenty of space. And it's very clean. It's very well organized. Yeah. And yeah. They have water everywhere. Yeah. And uh, the, race, the race course, you know, I think when we have the East Coast, we were too close to land. I think, yeah, I think I agree. the first three days there, and the first three races there, yeah. it's not very good. Man. It's been better on the Edinburgh Cup. Yeah, they've certainly learned from, from this, haven't they? And um, we're in a race in September, September as well. Would that make, I mean, the weather in September, do we think it's going to be more wind? Yeah, yeah I think. Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, it's, yeah. I will say at today's race, uh, you know, we had to start with black flag. Yeah. And uh, uh, the race officer had been quite quick with black flag. Yeah. And he said he will set the black flag in the second start. Yes. But uh, there have been some occasions where, yesterday, for example, there, there were 15 degrees or 20 degrees down in the pen. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, uh, and, and before that, uh, all the boat have a collision down there, and and the pen and boat uh, are, are fiddling around, yeah. and uh, it's very hard to get around that boat. I know. Yeah. And they, they should put the anchor down in the, in the on the stern. Yeah, they should have two anchors. If, sure. if if we should try to to uh, help them a little yeah. bit and learn something for the world. So for sure, for sure. I think if there's a wind shift and it's not clear. He should give it another chance and yeah. the black flag. Yeah, black flag is a tough one. Yeah, yeah, it is. So there are all the points that, uh, that I'm sure that the committee here will take on board. Um, do you think you can do it again? How many Edinburgh Cups have you won? I think it's five. Five yeah. Edinburgh Cups, okay. I have many seconds, so yeah. I'm used to it. I've <laughs> been second to you a couple of times too. So, um, well, very well done again, Grant, Thank for you your win. Thank you. And uh, for you, uh, you're coming back for the Worlds? Well, we're not sure at this stage. Uh, it's, it's early. Have you qualified? Um, I don't even know if I've qualified. Okay. But it's, it's early stages. It's great to be in this class. It's yeah. great to have a competition like Paul here and yeah. many others in the fleet. So delighted to be here and uh, to have our first bullet. Yeah, great. And uh, and thank you. I mean, on behalf of the class, Paul Ricard, for everything that you've done and making it all possible for all of us to sail this uh, wonderful boat. So uh, look out tomorrow. We'll tell you who wins. It's between four, four players, possibly five, and uh, you'll hear it here first from me. Thank you, gentlemen, and uh, good luck to everyone for tomorrow. Thank you. Thanks, Pete. Thank you. Thank you.